When it comes to agricultural technology, New Holland is arguably at the forefront, leading with its innovative concepts for sustainable and autonomous future. In the last decade, it has released concept tractors powered by hydrogen and methane, with the aim of achieving zero emissions in the foreseeable future. Just recently, its driverless concept tractor made an appearance at the Equip Field Days in Canada, New South Wales. While it looks just like any other tractor in New Holland's range, it can be operated with or without a driver in the seat. It's about getting the idea and the concept of autonomy across to the growers and understanding what level of autonomy they need from their machine. Is it a full autonomous tractor? Is it a machine that they can monitor remotely? And it's about gauging what the, what the people want for a machine in their field. I think it'd be more practical to understand that this is the most logical step in auto guidance and auto steering. Um, we're here to show off the technology that, that we have available to us and what we can do. Being an autonomous machine, the tractor is chock-a-block with some of the most advanced technologies on the market, mostly derived from the automotive and military industries that have been dabbling with driverless technology for a while. The machine behind us uses a number of uh, advanced technologies, LiDAR, radar, RGB cameras and uh, GPS. So we're using four different systems that work as a redundancy for each system. The machine can be operated remotely. Uh, what this allows you to do is monitor the operation of the machine, where it is, where it's going and what's happening with the implement behind. So this version we have behind us uh, allows both autonomous and non-autonomous or a level of autonomous operation. So we can still actually drive it or we can operate it by the, uh, the tablet. At this point in time, the autonomous technology remains a concept but response to the technology has been fairly positive. There's been some scepticism, I, I would say, over autonomous, but uh, when they stand here and we, we talk to them about the potentials and the opportunities, yeah, it's been, been very positive response. Uh, what we want to develop is a fully integrated system, so something that manages big data, uh, something that understands what's behind it and works with you and, and the machine to make the correct decisions. The next step for New Holland is to collect further feedback from growers on how they would like to utilise the technology, tweak the concept to suit and look into the commercial viability of such a machine. Uh, the autonomous industry is going to be a $30 billion industry and being forefront of that with agriculture, uh, we believe we're in a good place and in the right direction.